everyone, and welcome to another newscast. My name is Sam Healy, and in this video, we're going to show you all of the latest news about our projects as well as the company. As always, if you don't want to watch the entire video, you can skip to the parts that interest you by utilizing the timestamps in the description below. For general news today, though, as a reminder, we are currently unable to respond to Kickstarter messages due to the high volume of requests that we're getting throughout all of our projects. And we're trying to funnel all requests into one place so that we can decrease our response time and ultimately provide better service for your requests. So please kindly send your questions to our customer support team at support at mythicgames.net, and they will be delighted to help you. Now concerning our newscast videos, there will not be another episode of newscast until Tuesday, August 10th. I'll be going on vacation and won't be able to keep up with it while I'm away. Leo will also be on vacation for nearly the same amount of time, and after this week, his live Q&As will resume on August 11th. This week we only have new information for Reichbusters, Project Real, Steam Watchers, and Hell the Last Saga. So let's get to it. Concerning the errata packs for Reichbusters, VFI Asia is sending them out to our Asian backers with Steam Watchers. So please keep an eye out for your errata packs arrival soon. As a reminder, our Australia and New Zealand backers will also be receiving their errata packs with the shipment of Steam Watchers. Those containers are already on the water now and heading to the ports. So if you need to change your address, please contact us at support at mythicgames.net. Now, if we don't hear from you by next Wednesday, July 28th, then you'll have to change it when you get sent the address verification from the hubs. For Steam Watchers this week, the EU boat should be landing any day now at the port. Meeple Logistics will be sending address verifications out very soon, so please make it a priority to respond to that verification, as they will not send out your product if you don't. VFI Asia is halfway done sending Steam Watchers out, so keep an eye out in Asia for your copy to arrive soon. In North America, Australia, and New Zealand, your boats are on the water now heading to the ports. So again, if you need to change your address, please contact us at support at mythicgames.net. And again, if we don't hear from you by next Wednesday, July 28th, you'll have to change it when you get sent the verification emails from the hubs. For Hell the Last Saga today, we've seen the comments on how some of you are concerned about the current economic environment, especially the global surge in manufacturing and delivery prices, and you'd like to know our position on this issue. For delivery costs, for example, we've seen, like most publishers, an increase of no less than 450% in the price of a container. For now, there's nothing we can do but hope that the situation comes back to normal at the end of the year when we'll have to reserve and order these containers. Moving on, while our hard-working developers and storytellers are completing the final script and collecting feedback from the ongoing external testing, the designers started putting together the images and photos of the art book's painting gallery. He then realized that some painted figures were still unseen and never shown until now except on Leo's live videos. He spoils a lot of this kind of stuff. So while we're waiting to show them through our photo studio, we couldn't resist showing you a preview of at least one of those original pieces painted by Sebastian Levine. You'll meet these horsemen near the end of your journey and having them chasing you or facing you down isn't going to be good news any way you look at it. Otherwise, while waiting for the next update, we'd like to invite you to ask your questions concerning this project directly in the comments section of the Kickstarter page. The designer, David Rokoto, will be coming alongside me and answering them, and we'll endeavor to answer them personally in the next update. So it's going to be kind of like a FAQ uh, for the production status of Hell. And that update will be published the last week of August with an update of the progress chart as well. So please, as a reminder, all of the technical questions concerning any of our products, like payment problems, address changes, uh, the pledge manager questions, delivery questions, replacements, refunds, all of that must absolutely go through our customer service by sending an email to support 
at mythicgames.net uh, because it's simply the most efficient way to get an answer for your questions. Now remember that Leo will be live tomorrow at 6 p.m. GMT, 1 p.m. Eastern Time on our YouTube channel with a live Q&A in English and at 8.30 p.m. Paris Time with a live Q&A in French. So tune in if you have any questions or if you just want to see what he might spoil because, as we said, he does do that quite frequently, because he likes to. Um, but also remember that that's going to be his last live Q&A for a couple of weeks, and he'll be back in swing on August the 11th. Newscast will be back in swing on August 10th. So that's it for this week. Stay safe, play some games while you're at it, and we'll see you on the flip side. Take care. Music